happy Saturday. This is an Angela Anaconda episode that I actually got a request to do. It's called Model Behavior. Now I've seen it before, but it's been a little while, and I'm happy to revisit it. So. Today is library day. The day our class goes to the library so each of us can pick out our own book. Johnny's sleeping. Okay, I'm just an avid reader. How about watching where you walk, Angela Anaconda? Now there's a novel idea. <laughs> Notice the amount of puns in the show. I approve. Dare to be a goddess. Excuse me, that's obviously mine. And since I'm certain there are no books on brain replacement therapy in the beauty and glamour section, may I suggest you vamoose, which is French for clear the aisle. I'm using it as a runway. A runway? Like for airplanes? <laughs> When Instagram becomes a thing, and then that's the kind of person who posts a ton of selfies. They'd be her biggest commenters. So, you want to come over? We got a new flavor of multinational coffee. I can't, Gina Lash. I'm working. My mom got her very first sculpture. Yay, child labor! need to be her official sculpture assistant. Sounds impressive. Child labor laws notwithstanding. Oh! Say that again, Tina Lash. <laughs> if it weren't my own life, I'd be jealous. If Nanette keeps that up, her head's going to get flattened. <laughs> Thought. <laughs> anyway, who would ever want Ninny Ward for a model? Especially when there are classic shapes like ours to choose from. Glamorous. <laughs> well, have a good weekend, Angela Anaconda. A bunch of fantasies in this. I approve. Bye. I like the way they do it here. Hi, sweetheart. Hi, Mom. When do we start? As soon as you want. Our model just arrived. Oh, boy. Hello, Angela. Nanette, what are you doing here? I'm here for my modeling session. What else? You mean you're making a statue of her? That's right. I've been okay, this raises the question because... Your mother tells me you're going to be my little assistant. <laughs> okay. So, Here's the air purifier you requested, Nanette. Now, mm. Nanette's family's really rich, and they could have a sculpture of her. Fine. I'm sure rich people do that. But they could afford a lot of different artists, and they pick the anacondas. I think Nanette just wants to spend the day with her. <laughs> now I will do everything in my power to forget it. <clears throat> oh, Angela, dear. You know I'm not supposed to move, so be a doll and fetch me another glass of water, would you? Does she really need to be here, Mom? <clears throat> of course she does. She's my model. <clears throat> oh, Angela! Oh, this <laughs> her away from directly oh, trying to spend time, time with her. A glass of milk. It's important for us models to maintain strong cheekbones. Oh, and Angela, this time... Oh, the cheekbones thing, that became a thing, especially a in nerd culture. For you. Huh. Evil faces, they're great here. Maybe we should call the Manoirs and tell Nanette not to come over. I like the creative way she's trying to get out of this, too. Oh, it's just fruity flakes. But, but, Mom! <laughs> Mom, I think King Stop, please! And with Nanette and her sensitive skin coming over, oh. I think it's going to be a problem. No problem at all. Out you go, girl. Oh. Also, a, girl, a female dog named King, yes. Because power. Toodles, mother. Thanks ever so. Pause to perfect pressures. Oh. And don't forget to... Oh, dear heavens. I broke a nail. Huh. They did that joke. Is I'm that sorry, supposed to be painful? I mean, I always had short nails. It's come up. And it looks as though my mother... Oh, look. It's my mom. Oh, hello, I like how she's trying to get away from her as much as possible. Thank and she brought Angela. the dog. And please, try not to wrinkle my belongings. And please try not to wrinkle my belongings. Where are you going to put them? 
drop kick. All right. There's an awkward pause in the middle for some weird, weird reason. I really got to get myself the DVD sets. Do, do, do. I'm having fun. A bunch so of bench fancies. Still as possible. I've brought over this little bell that I can ring every time I need you to bring me something. For instance. Fetch me a cold glass of orange juice. And please, no pulp. And don't forget a clean glass. I still oh, think she treats January you know and Carly in this way, too. To so can you please come and scratch my nose? After you've washed your hands. <laughs> How can someone call herself a model when her parents are paying for her to be one? Oh, I bet they also pay for her to be Instagram you famous, know? too. I swear to God. <laughs> yeah! Bitch. Subtle pun. Oh. At least there's still one place that Nanoodle can't get to. My bedroom. <gasps> what are you doing here? Taking a break? You have no idea how exhausting it is just standing there being beautiful. But this is my room! And I assume this is your diary? They have tried to read each other's diaries in this show, I'm just saying. In the closet, behind a bureau, in a box under lock and key. He really you looked for that! Careful. And by the way, if those are the highlights of your life, I suggest you try your hand at fiction. Why don't you try your hand at minding your own business, Nanette Manure? I think she should have said, maybe you should take your hand and slap it across your face. <laughs> Alright, vengeance. Welcome to my studio. So you are going to be a model. The first thing you will want to do is practice your posture. Allow me. Ooh. Here. Since my Drop it on her head. Drop it on her head. So many famous grown-up things I have done are over your head. Let's put them over your head. <laughs> Nanity, thy name must definitely be Nanity. All this practicing to be the perfect model has made you more bent over than before. Angela, Angela. Whoa, hey. Hello, cartoony uh, violence. You will beg me. Help me to be posture perfect like kind a funny, just model. Kind of funny, just like an accordion. Very lovely, too. You're not, oh, slouching one. I have just the stuff <laughs> to be standing straight and tall. This plaster of Paris, which is French, like you are not, will keep you stiff as a board while I mold you into a beautiful statue. Oh, no. Now, none of those I wonder if it's stupid Teddy, but I kind of wanted her to give her a mustache. I guess I'll just have to use my Super. skills as an assistant sculptor to whittle you down to size. All right. Oops. Yes, I was so busy getting you things, I didn't learn as much about sculpting as you probably would have liked, Nano Ninny. But don't fret, <laughs> tiny small. on French one. Your I think you could have dismembered her, too. It sure use an attractive hood ornament. Oh, uh, I could have run her over. Side, but careful. <laughs> oh, oh, oh Angela's driving the car. Swarm of yucky bugs. Oh, oh, hey, I'd like to be, uh, like in the queen. Kablam shorts. We can't they can possibly both come back. Yay. Mosquito carcasses all over your delicate complexion. We'll have you good as new before you can say, please don't wriggle my belongings. Oh, hey, Snow White. <laughs> What's that? Nice musical board? score. Of the statue frozen with a her pissed off Did face. Did you hear me, sweetie? Will you please see who that is? Okay, mom. Oh, Mrs. Menor's back. Oh, how quaint. Hola. And please try not to wrinkle our belongings. <laughs> Welcome. And now for the moment you've all been waiting for. Well. Oh. Yeah, pretty good. It simply won't do. It's beautiful, of course. It's on a net, but it really should be bigger. It would look ridiculous. I bet they didn't specify what they wanted either. Which is French for vestibule? 
Perhaps you should just let them keep it. It's not too small for their house. <gasps> what a charitable idea, princess. <laughs> Throw his money at her like a stripper. What the hell? Vestibule. Oh, Even though they probably didn't specify no what they wanted, the they did pay them, which is more than you could say for people who wanted to pay you an exposure. I know just the place. Oh. Well, what do you think? <laughs> Let's ask the expert. Here, girl! sadistic but I still enjoyed it. There was also an abundance of them earlier in the episode. So yay.